Some parents are upset after finding out a teacher who they say made inappropriate contact with their daughter is back at Columbia High School. TV 20's Ethan Badowski tells us how this came about. Trey Hosford, you got some questions that need to be answered. Lex Carswell, the superintendent, you got some questions that need to be answered. Ronald Williams Jr. is angry on behalf of his friends Shalita and Chris Mira. They say their daughter was contacted inappropriately by a teacher at Columbia High School five years ago. Now, Chris Martinez has returned to the school as the PE coach and defensive coordinator. We are extremely concerned because this individual is now back in the Columbia County school system with the opportunity to groom other young women uh, in the same way that he not only tried to groom our daughter, but other young women as well. Martinez resigned from CHS before he could be fired five years ago. Since then, he has worked at schools in both Sewanee and Union Counties. Officials here at Columbia High School say that the allegations against Martinez were cleared and there were no criminal charges presented. However, the Mira say investigators were not able to get the full picture. It was all done via Instagram or, any, or other social media platforms. Even the Columbia County Sheriff's Department Department couldn't subpoena the records from Instagram. Investigators cited a lack of evidence when clearing Martinez, saying they couldn't read any messages to back up the claims. So all you have is the statements from these victims and their, and, and, and their word and why that wasn't good enough when you didn't even have a response from the one who was being accused. You know, silence to me is complicity. We reached out to the Columbia County Sheriff's Office, the school board, Columbia High School, and Chris Martinez himself. None of them chose to comment. In Lake City, Ethan Badowski, TV 20 News.